Hey guys, in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how you can turn your PC into a Wi-Fi hotspot. Now first things first, what you need uh, for that is Connectify and you can download that from the link given here. I'll even put that in the description box below. So once you download that, um, install it and just simply run Connectify. And then for the first time, if it runs, it's gonna show you all these options as your hotspot name. That's gonna be your SSID. You know, specify a password, whatever you wish. Um, internet to share, choose the uh, option in green with the three green Wi-Fi bars on it. That should be the option that you should choose. And share or Wi-Fi, that should again do the same thing for the other two. And for this one, for the sharing mode, uh, there are three options, but instead of the uh, the ones that say ad hoc, choose the uh, Wi-Fi access point, and that should be WPA2 encrypted. That's also better than the WEP or the open encryption because it is the most secure method to connect to the internet and it's not easily hackable, unlike WEP or open your you're pretty much leaving yourself open to any attacks and anybody in the neighborhood can connect to your internet. So once you have that, uh, you can start Hotspot, and it should take a few moments to boot it up. Uh, now in the light version, and I don't think it allows you to share your files, but if you buy the full version, I believe it enables you to do so. Now I already have my uh, Samsung Galaxy S connected to it, so I'm gonna connect to my connectify me network right now that's what is going to show up in your wireless device list i think it's going to even show up here mm -hmm. so yeah see so connectify me no network access but that just means that it's working properly all right so let's find me connect getting ip address all right. so it's connected on my phone and i should refresh that and it should give me uh, the option saying that it should be connected to the uh, hotspot. Oh, there we go. So by default it should give you your MAC address and it's highly recommended that you change that for security features. Now the reason I recommend this over the ad hoc feature that Windows provides you with is well there are several reasons for it. First of all it's very easy to set up and maintain like I showed it to you and there are no, there's no need to possess either an ethernet cable that you need to be directly connected with the modem or the router uh, or you don't even need to possess uh, another Wi-Fi card in order to connect to the internet and uh, have an ad hoc network set up and you can continue using your internet on your PC and your uh, phone simultaneously. I was using the internet on my phone just now and it's working perfectly fine. And as you can see, the internet on my PC is working fine as well, independent of whether or not this application is running or not. Also, another feature is that some users have really complained about the uh, Windows ad hoc feature uh, that they're not, even though they're able to build the uh, ad hoc network they're not able to connect to the phone um, like they're the, the device on their phone is not showing up as as a hotspot but with connectify me or connectify you wouldn't have that problem so I guess that's about it for this tutorial if you have any problems or concerns just leave them in the comment section below like comment and subscribe and if you have any other suggestions, leave them in the comment box below as well. Peace!